tutorial we are going to replace your video with 3D CGI character using Wonder Studio. Also how to make this transition effect in Premiere Pro. Using Wonder Studio you can replace anything with 3D character. It also automatically composites the scene by adding lightings. It also motion captures your hand movement gestures and also facial expressions. Also you can replace with multiple characters. So first open Premiere Pro and drag and drop your video. For the transition part I will export this video from 6 seconds and 4 frames. Go to file, go to export then select media. Now take this cursor to 6 seconds and 4 frames. Then click this starting point and export this part of video. After exporting, go to Wonder Studio website, link is in the description. This is currently in beta version. You need to click request access and fill this entire form to get Wonder Studio. Or else you can mail to this mail id. Within 3 to 4 weeks, you will get the access. Once you get the access, open Wonder Studio. Here you can see all 3D CGI characters created by Wonder Studio. Now click on new project. Now click here to import your video. Then drag this to the timeline. Now click on next, then click on scan frame for actor. Here you can see all the 3D characters. We can choose any of these characters and many characters are coming soon. Before you assign any character, make sure you select the actor, then you can replace it with any 3D character. Then click on next. Here you can choose video resolution. Also in some situation where actor go behind the walls or close camera angle shots it fails to composite the scene. In that case you can use alpha mask, clean plate or blender scene to composite by yourself. You can export in mp4 or png sequence format. Then click on start processing. It will take some time. Once it's done download the video. Now open Premiere Pro and go to 6 seconds and 4 frames. Delete this audio layer. Press C and make a cut here then delete this part of video. Now import the exported video and drag it here. Also delete the audio for this video. Now if you play this, it's already done but transition is missing. Now select this video then add keyframes on position and scale. Go to first frame then scale it and position it on the right side. Now you will have this kind of animation. Now go to this keyframe and set the position to left side. Now go few frames forward, then reset the position and scale. Now I think transition is too fast. Now slightly increase all the keyframes. To make it slow, also make them easy in out.
now you will have this kind of transition effect thank you so much for watching this tutorial make sure to subscribe to my channel